Hey, all you St. John's families, it's been a little while since I've done one of these video updates, but next week is a crazy week here at St. John's, so I just wanted to share some things with you. But before we get to next week, I want to let you know that our Ladies' Aid here at St. John's Lutheran Church is having a bazaar on November 5th, this Saturday, 8 a.m. to noon. They've got all kinds of different gifts and decor and jewelry and different things. Um, so we invite you all to come and join us for that this Saturday in our fellowship hall um, with the St. John's Ladies' Aid. But next week... We've got a number of different things happening, and it all leads up to our Veterans Day Assembly, which is on Thursday, November 10th at 1.30. So um, that's the, the focus, but let's lead up to that. First, Monday, pretty normal day, actually. There's not much different going on on Monday, November 7th, so that's the, the normal school day of the week. Tuesday, November 8th, no school. It's election day. Government says you have to take election day off now for school. So no school on Tuesday for election day. Wednesday, uh, we have been focused so far this school year on Operation Christmas Child. And it's now we've got, we've collected all the supplies. Now it's time to pack the boxes. And the students are going to help this, but we could also use some volunteers. So if you can help at all on Wednesday, November 9th, please let me know. So we're going to be packing all the students are going to help with this at different times during the day, not take the entire day, but we'll have them come in, help us to pack some of the boxes. Um, and then at two o'clock in the afternoon, we're going to pray over the boxes. And then at 2.15, we're going to have the great pumpkin drop. I don't know if you've experienced this. I've heard about it and I'm looking forward to it. Uh, but I guess we throw pumpkins off the roof and it's just a blast and everybody has a good time. So we're doing that on Wednesday, November 9th at 2.15. Then on Thursday, uh, Thursday, November 10th, uh, in the morning, K-8 through has a field trip. We're all going to the Little Theater um, in Sullivan for a show on Thursday morning. But then in the afternoon, it's all about that Veterans Day assembly. And this is where we want to recognize as many relatives and friends of St. John's as possible and all of our students. So there's two ways um, to get involved with this. First of all, all veterans are welcome and invited to come and attend the Veterans Day Assembly. We'd love to have them join us here, 1.30 in our gym, Thursday, November 10th. If they can or if they can't join us, we want to recognize the relatives who are veterans of our students. And you can do that by sending us a picture and information about that veteran um, to a special email that we created. It's veteransdayassembly at sgjls-mattoon.com. So the ending is the same as all of our emails, but the first is all one word, no capitalization, veteransdayassembly at stjls-mattoon.com. Send us picture of uh, a relative in in, in um, maybe in their in their uniform. Uh, tell us what branch they served in, what their rank was, the years that they served, those types of things. We're going to include it in a video collage that we're going to have as part of our assembly. So um, we want to, to do that for all of the family members of our students. So if a student has a parent, grandparent, aunt, uncle, cousin, whatever it might be, we'd love for you to send us that information. I think I've gotten 26 emails already to that account um, with those things, but we'd love to have everybody that, that wants to be part of that. And again, we would love to invite all veterans to join us for our annual assembly Thursday, November 10th, 1.30 in our gym. K through 8 are all involved with this program, and I'm really looking forward to it, okay? Friday, of course, there's no school because it is Veterans Day. So next week, big week, all kinds of different stuff happening. Appreciate you taking the time to hear about those things. Have a great day.